Okay, this is just a little quickie on a heat exchanger I found. Uh, your inducer sat right here. The uh, burners shot into here, two burners, probably 50,000 each, my guess, something like that. And this is a tube type heat exchanger. All it means is, it looks like a set of exhaust pipes. It's about the same thickness and it is aluminized steel. Uh, this one has a problem. You can see part of the problem. Uh, it's probably easier to see right there. You can see the aluminized portion is gone off of that. Now remember the hottest part of this heat exchanger is going to be right here where the fire comes in. That's going to be the hottest part, and that's the part that if it's going to fail, it will fail first. Now, this heat exchanger, let's take a little look a little farther down into this thing. So, as the gases come through and go down here, they cool off. Now, they're pretty hot right here. Uh, they go down there into a manifold. Let me kind of show you this. They go down into a manifold, come back through the dented pipe that's supposed to induce swirl or turbulence or some silly thing. And then it goes uh, back out and uh, to the vent. But what I wanted to show you most was this. Okay. What's happened this thing has been massively overfired. You can see all the aluminizing is gone. This tube here has not broken yet, but there is a crack in it. If you look close, you can see that crack right there. But the other one, it has actually, this metal has gotten so hot it's turned red but when it turns red it loses all its strength. Uh, so this has been massively overfired. Now you can see, I mean, there's just nothing left of this stuff. Uh, massive overfiring, turn that one into your uh, manufacturer, you'll laugh in your face and give it back to you and say fix it yourself. Uh, by the way, you can't fix it. You do have to replace these, but they're not going to do a free heat exchanger or something like that. You overfire it that way, there is no way they're going to eat that sucker. So, this is a good reason to uh, check firing rate every time you uh, service.